Welcome back to College Cooking. My name is Alan Burgess, and we're on the campus of Wichita. We'll be making ourselves a good meal today, a high rise doing the tour, so we'll see you inside. Oh, hey there, I'm just getting all this stuff ready to go for this fudge. Uh, here we have, uh, we're going to be making, like I said, fudge today. All you have to do is get milk chocolate chip morsels, semi sweet chocolate chip morsels, one can 14 ounce of condensed sweetened milk, and a microwavable safe bowl. This is going to be a little bit different from the normal fudge that your grandmother makes where she labors over the uh, stove. We're going to make ours in the microwave. As I said, this is dorm friendly. Here's what we're going to do. Pour one bag of the semi-sweet morsels into a microwavable safe bowl. And then one can of the sweet condensed milk. You're going to pour that into the bowl also. Once you have that in there, just go ahead and stir it up just to get it mixed. And one thing you can do, uh, depending on the kind of fudge that you like, uh, if you want it a little bit more creamier, sweeter, uh, this is what we have this uh, milk chocolate chip morsels for. Uh, milk chocolate chip. We'll pour ourselves a half cup. Or if you want more, it doesn't really matter. But just go ahead and pour that in. And like I said, a little bit more creamier texture and a little bit sweeter taste. So now what we're gonna do, we're gonna stick this in here in the microwave for about two to three minutes. One of the things you have to do when you've got it into the microwave Set it at three minutes. You have to take it out at one minute intervals. Just give it a good stirring. And we'll just put it right back in for one more minute. Take it out, and stir it again. Uh, one thing you want to look for with this is you want it to be thick and creamy. Um, that looks really good. What we're going to do now, we get yourself an eight inch pan. We're going to get ourselves just some pan, just kind of grease it up so it won't stick to the pan. Right there, we're just going to pour this in here. Um, you know, you can be a lot with this recipe. Uh, if you want to put in some nuts, uh, fruit, marshmallows, you know, it's pretty much you can do whatever you want to. Uh, I would definitely uh, get creative with it. Uh, you know, if you like fruit or your chocolate or what, whatnot, um, you know, make it your own. So we're going to put this in the uh, refrigerator, let it cool. We'll come back here in a second with the finished product. As you can see, we have our final product. Uh, we've just let this cool in the refrigerator uh, just enough to where it's firm and it's not hot. So we're going to give it a try. There we go. That is very, very good. Tastes just like your grandmother's fudge. Mmm. That is good. Like I said, this is college cooking with fudge. Simple, easy, tasty. What more can you ask for?